Hey everybody, today I wanted to talk to you about how I manage my keyboard, actually not my keyboard, but my tabs on, in Safari using Keyboard Maestro macros so that I can uh, move between them and manage them relatively quickly. Here's what I mean. So I'm gonna open up Safari right now. Here's Safari. And I have these four windows open. And everybody knows you can um, t type Command T to open a new tab. Well, I'm going to close the uh, tab now using Command W. Now, here is here are the ones that are already open. Like, let's see this, the athletic tab. I can close the tabs to the left of that specific tab that's active, the athletic, by going caps lock T and tapping L. Here it says the macro is left of current tab. Close. So I'm going to, this is the um, keyboard maestro conflict palette. The trigger for all these macros is caps lock T and then I simply hit L for left, and it closes the macro. Now, I'm going to go um, open them back up again. Oh, it's not opening up. Okay. Maybe because they are... Um, because the, the group is already open for some reason. I don't know, I'm not sure. But I'm gonna go back to history and open the last closed tabs. Even that has uh, some macros, or so, sorry, some keyboard um, shortcuts, but here we are at the athletic again. Now I'm gonna do a command, or not command, caps lock T once again. But this time it's gonna go in the other direction. It's gonna go to the right. And I just simply hit R and it closes all the tabs that are to the right of the currently active tab, like so. So these two macros are done using a simple Apple script in Keyboard Maestro. So let's examine it right now. I'm gonna minimize this and I'm gonna hit caps lock K to launch the keyboard maestro editor and i'm going to go to the uh, safari group um, let's see where it is here apple safari and now i'm going to these are the three tabs or the three macros that we are examining today. Here is the left um, macro for the closing tabs to the left. It says you simply enter the execute Apple script action. So I can do it via here and adding an action so you type execute and here is 
Apple Apple script um, the Apple script action and you simply would put this code in here but we don't need this right now because we are it's already built so this is just um, this is going to close the uh, tabs to the left of the currently active tab okay now we're going to go um, and look at another action. So we're going to close this um, macro and we're going to go to look at the close, the ones to the right. And this is closing the ones to the right. So this simply close. Uh, this is closes the the tabs to the right, and it keeps going until there is no more tabs. And both of these um, Ma uh, Apple scripts, I will have in a paste bin, in a link below my uh, video. So that's how the closed tabs uh, to the right of the current active uh, one works. And then the final one, which is closing all but the current active tab. So I'm going to close this macro. And I'll go back up to um, Safari. And let's say I wanted to close all um first let's open all the tabs again and i'm going to close this so i'm going to go back here and open add file espn The athletic does say tech crunch okay so all I have these one two three five tabs open no nope, I have four and Let's see, let's say here's this um, WordPress template that I'm also looking at. So I'm going to open that one as well. And let's say I want all the tabs except closed except for the athletic. So it is the active tab now. And I simply hit command or caps lock t like i've done before but this time hit o for other tabs close so it's going to close every tab except for the this active one and i simply hit o and there you go all the other tabs are gone and how that is completed is if i open um let's minimize this and take a look at this macro. It's simply a type uh, keystroke action. So I would go up here and set and type type and keystroke. And this is where this comes from. And then the Option W or Option Command W that comes from the Safari shortcut. That is, if you hold uh, 
your option key down and click on uh, I believe it's uh, is it file or edit maybe oh, I think it's file yeah and then it, here it is close other tabs that's where that comes from if it if it had other tabs open this would be filled in so that's how I manage my Safari tabs using the the wonderful keyboard maestro and I've um, created three separate macros for, just for managing tabs in Safari. Now I have to be clear these scripts well the close other tabs uh, will have another command in another browser but the close left and close right scripts work only with uh, Safari and they'll probably work with um, Google Chrome because those two applications are scriptable while uh, Firefox is not. I struggled with that yesterday, trying to figure out why I couldn't accomplish the same thing using uh, Firefox. All right. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please like and subscribe and comment and I will see you all in the next video.